Tom. Tom Galvin. I'm the uh, the police chief here in the town of Berlin. Yeah. And uh, we're at an interesting time here in uh, in the town, in the state, in the country, and in the world. Um, a lot of what we're doing now is new territory for all of us um, in public safety, in municipal management. Um, you know, we just want the people to know that we continue to work for them. We are operating as close as possible to business as usual. Things have gone really well, you know, especially in our community. There's been a lot of good things that have happened. Um, you know, the communities come together. Um, there's a Berlin uh, Facebook page that I'm sure many are familiar with. And to see the stories on there and the posts on there of neighbors offering to go shopping for people, offering to take seniors' trash to the transfer station, um, people that are now making masks or collecting goggles to send to hospitals, um, the uh, birthday parades that we're now seeing that are becoming commonplace. We have a lot of young people that, that aren't able to celebrate birthdays like they normally will, um, and even older people. We had one this past weekend for a gentleman who has turned 90 years old. Um, so it's a great way for the community to come together. Um, you know, one other thing that I think people should really take to is this has allowed us to slow down, reconnect with family, um, do some things that our life had not allowed us to do. One thing that we notice in public safety is a lot of things occur in our interactions with the police occur because we're always in a hurry. And that doesn't happen right now. The roads are quiet. People are staying home. And uh, you know, it, it allows us to, to bond and connect with our families and, and with our neighbors. You know, we don't have to stand next to them to talk, but we've seen stories from across the country where people are singing out windows and in driveways, um, kids that are drawing messages in chalk that are being filmed and, and broadcast on social media and across the news. So there's so many good things that have come out of this that uh, you know, in the end, we're, we're going to come out stronger as a, as a community, and uh, you know, I'm happy about that. Uh, my name is Ken Clark, and I'm the fire chief and the emergency management director for the town of Berlin. I enjoy the small town atmosphere that I find in Berlin. Reminds me a lot of where I came from in Hopkinton. But like the chief said, and I want to echo that, is that uh, families have, have come together. I can only speak for my own, but I have older sons that are usually off with their friends every night, and now they're home watching TV or sitting at the table with us talking about something. So I think there's been an enhanced ability for the families to bond, and it's like, it's really nice to see. And I keep telling the boys, uh, we just got to keep discipline, stay in our lanes. I would also like the, uh, the town of Berlin to know that their public safety personnel are ready to respond, as always, on a moment's notice. They're always going to be there. You call, we will be there. No change in that, I can guarantee you. And I think that hopefully after May 4th, when the ban is lifted, if, if it is, it's like uh, next day Cinco de Mayo, so we'll be in good shape. <laughs>